Hello everyone, it's Ryan with Frontline Animal Removal. Today I want to show you some evidence that there's bats in a gable vent without actually showing you the bats at first. There we have our gable vent. Now if we look at the gable vent, there's no obvious sign of bats that is obvious. But if we look close to the house, that's a bat dropping. That's a piece of bat dropping. There's a piece of bat dropping there. And then up there, there's a couple other dark spots on the side. So often when bats fly to the house, they go poo poo, and little pieces of bat poo stick to the side of the house. There's another sign up there that there's bats. So let's go up close and look. Now if you look right here, we see paint peeling. And Bat poo, bat poo. Now, let's see if we can see what's going on with the bats with my handy dandy bat hook. Where are you, you little fur balls? There's a bat right there. Now, what's going on as the bats roost on the wood? They urinate and the urine gets behind the paint and blisters the paint off and the poo also helps deteriorate the wood this right here all this paint coming off is from bat urine there's a strong smell up here which I can't share with you because uh, technology hasn't advanced it much Let's see if we got any more bats See, there's another bat. Now these guys are acting slow and lethargic because it's a cool morning. And they're all in a state of torpor. And there's another bat. So my tip for you is, if you suspect bats are living in your bat or in your gable vents, you've seen a couple come or go step back and take a look at the vents. If you see paint peeling off, some stain marks, they're living there. If everything looks really nice and spotless and clean and you happen to see one or two go by, it's probably just the beginning. Now fortunately with this house, they have not gone through the screen in the vent yet. So I do not believe these bats are in the attic. So all we have to do is flush the bats out of the vent and put screen over it and we'll be done. Uh, there's a matching vent on the other side of the house that we would do the same. So that's my tip. Look to see if there's stain marks and peeling paint. Thank you.